surprise. You're eating Fukushima radiation, bloody cancerous tumors in fish and seafood. Is fish safe to eat? That's becoming an incredibly hard question to answer. Typically you want select fresh wild seafood instead of farmed, but avoiding seafood might be a trend of the future. According to reports from Superstation 95. As of June, 2015, the radiation in the Pacific Ocean reached the U.S. West Coast. The seafood you've been eating from the Pacific Ocean is loaded with cesium-137 and strontium-90. Both radioactive. Strontium-90 mimics calcium. It ends up getting deposited in human bones, where the radiation wreaks havoc with bone marrow, causing bone cancers and blood cancers like leukemia. The radiation in the fish is so terrible that wild-caught Alaskan salmon, Pacific herring and Canadian whitefish are being found bloody, with cancerous tumors throughout their bodies. It's terrifying that more and more healthful foods are slowly becoming unsafe to consume regularly. First with GMOs and Monsanto, now Fukushima radiation, you can get the full story from Superstation 95 here. However, some scientists disagree. According to Jay Cullen, an associate professor of ocean sciences at the University of Victoria, to be very direct about it. At the levels that we're seeing, if one were to consume 20 kilos, over 40 pounds, of salmon in a year, the dose that one experiences from consuming that fish is about 300 fold less significant than if you're a pack a day cigarette smoker. Weigh the research and make your decision carefully.